US military releases video it says implicates Iranian regime in oil tanker attack. The US military has released a video it says implicates the Iranian regime's revolutionary guards in the attack on two oil tankers in the Gulf of Oman. The US Central Command on June 13th says the video shows crews from IRGC boats removing what looks like an unexploded mine from the side of one of two oil tankers that were attacked. Navy Captain Bill Urban, a Central Command spokesman, said in a statement, At 4.10 local time, an IRGC Gashti class patrol boat approached the MT Kokua Courageous and was observed and recorded removing the unexploded limpet mine from the Courageous. Pompeo blames Iran for tanker attack. Trump expresses skepticism about Iran deal. U.S. Secretary of State Mike Pompeo says the U.S. believes the Iranian regime is responsible for attacks that damaged two oil tankers near the Persian Gulf. Pompeo said in a news conference Thursday that the attacks on the ships are part of a campaign of escalating tension by Iran and are a threat to international peace and security. Meanwhile, U.S. President Donald Trump has responded to this week's visit by Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe in Iran, saying on Twitter that he appreciated the effort but he believed that Iran and the United States are not ready for a deal. UK warns Iran over deeply unwise attacks on oil tankers. Britain is working on the basis that the Iranian regime is responsible for the attacks on two oil tankers in the Gulf of Oman on Thursday, and warned Tehran that these actions were deeply unwise, Foreign Secretary Jeremy Hunt said. This has been deeply worrying and comes at a time of already huge tension. I have been in contact with Mike Pompeo and we will be making our own assessments soberly and carefully. Our starting point is obviously to believe our US allies, Hunt said. Saudi Arabia agrees Iran was behind tanker attacks. Saudi Arabia agrees with the United States that the Iranian regime was behind the suspected attacks on two oil tankers in the Gulf, Saudi Minister of State for Foreign Affairs Adal El Jabbar said on Thursday. Twitter's elite's accounts tied to Iran seeks to end false information campaigns. Twitter on Thursday said it removed thousands of accounts linked to coordinated state-backed activities it believes were from the Iranian government and archived them to its public database launched last year. In the latest purge of information, the company says it believes 4,779 accounts were associated with or backed by Iran. Five prisoners hanged in Iran the Iranian regime has hanged five prisoners in Karaj, Ardabil and Gorgan. Three inmates were hanged in Goradash prison in Karaj on Wednesday, June 12. Also on Wednesday, the head of the Justice Department of Ardabil announced that they had executed an inmate in the local prison. On Sunday, Hashim Amiri, a married father of three, was hanged in the prison of Gorgan.